All right, so in our Spanish song, um, which again, we played, and we worked on shifting up out of position, um, but it's also got the same time signature and the same chords as the classical study we were playing, A minor, D minor, and E. Um, but the pattern's a little different. This isn't a composite pattern, this is just one pattern that gets played every single measure. Um, the tricky thing about this pattern is that it breaks up the arpeggio. You know, arpeggio is when you separate the notes. Well, this separates some of the notes and then keeps some of the notes together. So your third, second and third finger are kind of locked together and your first finger is independent while your thumb plays that bass note. Um, so I will play through the Spanish song so you can hear that pattern, um, which we had started working on in class. So here's the Spanish song. One, two, three. all the notes together, thumb, first, second, third, because they're all written right on top of each other, so we play them all together. All right, I hope that helps you as you work through that, that Spanish song. You guys are sounding good. Keep up the good work. You're learning a lot of independence in your right hand. As you're working on this, you can try to have a...